Hi, this is Kirsten Rouse with Focus Bar Coaching, and I'm going to do a super quick video today on behavioral-based interviewing. I was talking to a client today, and I told him I'd send him some stuff to read, and he said he didn't feel like reading, so here's your gift, and you guys get to benefit too. So behavioral-based interviewing is really important to include in any interview process because what it gets at is those softer skills, those behaviors that you need for someone to be successful in your business. Yes, it's important. You know, they might need a certain college degree or experience or skill sets, but the truth is, a lot of times, some of those things are easier to teach um, if they don't have them initially. What you can't teach is those customer service behaviors, teamwork, good communication, uh, someone who's highly motivated takes initiative. Those things are just kind of core skill sets that they're going to need, behaviors um, that they're going to need prior to coming into your organization. So to do a good behavioral-based interviewing question, you're first going to determine what personality traits, what behaviors you want in a successful person in your business. I'm going to use the example of customer service because almost any job is going to require some amount of customer service. So what you're going to do is ask a specific question that gets at past behaviors where the candidate has exhibited the kind of behavior that you're looking for in their past employment. And you're going to ask a question like this. Tell me about a time when you went above and beyond for a customer. Now, once you've asked the question, you're going to look for three key things. One, what was the specific scenario? Now, you're not looking for anecdotal stories or hypothetical situations. You're looking for real, true-life examples of where this person exhibited the kind of behavior that you're looking for. And if they're the right fit, they're going to have some good examples for you. So one, the specific example, what was going on? Was the customer unhappy? Did you just see an opportunity to wow them? What was going on? Two, what role did you play? So were you just a participant in a team taking care of it? Did someone tell you what to do? Or did you see the opportunity yourself and take the initiative? Three, what was the outcome? Was that customer wowed in the end? Were they satisfied? Was the issue resolved? What was the outcome? So those are the three key things you're going to look for in every question that you ask for behavioral-based interviewing. Um, again, the goal is to look at past behavior, because that's the best predictor of future behavior. And these are the key things that you want to make sure that you're getting a right fit, because you want this new employee to be a success in your organization. So there you have it. That's the basics on, in a very quick nutshell, of behavioral-based interviewing. If you need more information or assistance with any kind of leadership, human resource, team issues, please visit my website. Yeah, focusforwardcoaching.com. You can sign up for my newsletter. Um, there's also some additional uh, resources on behavioral-based interviewing. So I'm hoping that you all make it a great day. Bye.